What's up, YouTube, and ho, 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 Merry Christmas. My name is Domino, and welcome to the true beginning, episode number one of our Pokemon Platinum Severely Randomized Nuzlocke. Now, last week we had episode zero go up where I asked you to help me choose my starter, and it was a whole lot closer than I thought it was going to be. If you do want to go check out the introduction to this game where I also explained all the rules of what we've randomized as well as what a Nuzlocke is if you're unfamiliar, you can click the i card up at the top right of the screen. In any episode in this series, if you're behind on an episode, you can always click that i card to go to the episode beforehand. Now, in today's episode, we are going to be choosing our starter and hopefully getting a couple of encounters and then getting ourselves set up to go on to the next town. So if you're excited for the beginning of our adventure, make sure to hit the like button down below. If you want to become a member of the Domination so that you can follow along on our adventure through Sinnoh, make sure you hit the subscribe button as well. Now, to recap the rules, we've randomized everything in this game minus the move data. Um, which means like I, I just don't want like fire punch to be a water type move because that makes absolutely no sense And it kind of make cause a whole bunch of headaches that we had in Pokemon Crystal when we played that a couple months ago um, So we've randomized everything in the game as you can tell with our starters Which we'll go over in a second and then Nuzlocke rules you can find all of this stuff in the description down below now before we jump in I do have to go ahead and say this is the second time I've recorded episode one, but I realized that I had randomized it wrong. I ran I randomized it globally. So if a Pidgey was caught in, or if a Pidgey was encountered in route one and it was a an Abra, then in route two, if I if the normal game would have me encounter a Pidgey, that would also be an Abra. And that's not how I want to randomize the game. So we're doing it again. Whatever. <sighs> I, anyway, 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 so we're gonna go ahead and jump in now. Now, as we said, I did ask you guys to help me choose my starter, as a lot of you did, and the vote was a lot closer than I expected. First, we had Stantler. Stantler did come in third place. He got five votes. No. Yeah, so Stantler came in third. Uh, not important how many votes we got, but the last two, which was Meryl and Rhydon actually wound up being extremely close. Our starter is going to be not Marrow, it will be Rhydon, the drill Pokemon. So that's it. Oh wait, wait, I actually have to sing these out. Sorry, I was about to start clicking through because I've already done this once. Forgive me. Well shouldn't be shouldn't have any more mistakes like that. Very well, both of you have chosen a good Pokemon, it seems. Now listen well. The Pokemon you have been entrusted with are unfamiliar with the world. In that regard, they're very much like you. As fellow newcomers to this world, I hope you'll do well together. If you have any trouble, come see me at my, me at my lab in Sangim Town. And now, we'll be on our way. <sighs> Professor, wait for me, please! I'm sorry, please let me pass. How do you like that? Professor Rowan is re really nice. On TV, he seems so stern and scary. Hey, 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 Domino, we've both got Pokemon now. There's only one thing left to do, right? Are you up for this? I'd really rather not do this again. The first time, I got blown away. I'll explain it afterwards. What's with that attitude? Don't be that way. Hey, hey we both... Okay, I guess it just forces you into a battle. I've always wanted to say this. The time has finally come. Domino, I challenge you to a battle. First time, that music caught me off guard as well. And he picked... Stantler! You know what? I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna upload the actual episode one as a secret episode so you can check it out. It'll be in the description um, just so you can watch it because I got blown away here. Now let's see. It's completely re-randomized everything so that's good. That's good. I'm gonna go with Ice Punch. He has Rock Wrecker! Why do you have strong rock moves? Get the freeze, get the freeze, get the freeze! Uh, I'm gonna headbutt him. Oh, I should've ice punched him again and gone for another freeze, I'm so stupid! Ah oh, man. I would've... Oh no! 
Yeah, he missed! Yes, 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 yes! Yes! I'm so happy that I actually beat him. I did not beat him the first time. The first time... No, no, no. You'll have to go check it out. You'll have to go check it out. You can find it in the description below. Stop growing levels, please! What do you say? Okay, he... His tech skipped. Phew, let's go home. I'm beat after that battle. My Pokemon needs rest, too. See ya, Domino. Oh, I can't believe I... Oh. Anyway. What's the matter, dear? Wow, that's happened to you? You and Sam's are lucky to have met Professor Rowan. Imagine if you didn't. I wouldn't like to think what the wild Pokemon might have done to you two. Domino, go see Professor Rowan and thank him- Oh, wrong voice. It should be a little lower. Domino, go see Professor Rowan and thank him properly for your Pokemon. His lab is in Sangam Town, isn't it? Now that you have your own Pokemon, the tall grass won't be so threatening. Oh, I know, Domino. Put these on. Hold on. I need a drink, but I'm not pulling this because I'm not sponsored. And if any water places want to sponsor me. So I can drink your water on camera. Hold on. Hold on. At this point now, I've been talking for like an hour. I barely took any break between the two. There we go. Nice and empty water bottle. Okay. Woo! Going to San Sangam Town is like an, an adventure in itself, right? Those running shoes. I don't need instructions on running shoes. Thank you. All right, let's go ahead and... Oh, I forgot where I'm supposed to go. Oh, that's right, that's right, that's right. Too slow, Domino. I'm sick of waiting. I'm going to go see Professor Rowan so I can thank him properly. So, I had this great idea. Listen up, okay? You know that lake where we always play at, right? You know how they say a legendary Pokemon lives there? You guessed it. Let's catch that Pokemon. That'll make Professor Rowan happy. I'm sure of that. Me and you together, we've got nothing to fear. You know what's funny? It's just like Sam's to do something sneaky like this. Try to not get caught. Being of emotion apparently lives here. All right, we're at the lake. Get ready because we're capturing that legendary Pokemon. I lost his voice. Trust me on this one. It's here. He even says so on the sign. There we go. What's going on? The evil man himself. The flowing time, the expanding space. I will make it all mine one day. Cyrus is my name, remember it. Until then, sleep while you can, legendary Pokemon of the lake bed. Allow me to pass, step aside. Woo! What's that guy about, weird guy? Okay, Domino, let's catch that legendary Pokemon. That's Mesprit for you right there. Did you hear that, Domino? That was the legendary Pokemon crying. That had to be it. Okay, this is our chance. Let's catch it. Wait, what? We don't have anything on us. You know, Pokeballs. P-O-K accent E balls. If we don't have those, we can't catch Pokemon or take them around with us. I think Professor Rowan would give us some if we asked him. You know, you remember what he said, don't you? He said to visit him at his lab if we needed anything. Okay, Domino, I'll race you. First one of the professor's lab in Sangam Town rules. All right, so I'm gonna try to avoid the grass here. To be honest, I might have already seen the grass here because I was checking to see if it re-randomized because the game, after I re-randomized, it came back up in this exact place. Like I had already saved and everything. It was very weird. I don't know why it did that, but I guess we're gonna see Pokemon one way or another. That was one of the new ones. That was not what I encountered the first time. So I need to experiment here. Okay, I can use Headbutt on Caterpie. Now, you know what? Caterpie would actually be an amazing Pokemon to have because it evolves at level seven. And Blastoise, that was the other one I saw. Now, I don't think I want to kill, what did that just say? It has Wonder Guard. Does it really have Wonder Guard? Is that what it says? It has Wonder Guard. I can't even hit it. That's amazing. All right, cool, we got our potion. 
Alright, so... That's the only two Pokemon I had seen. So again, I don't know anything else that really is going to happen here. Oh, there you are! Please come with me! The professor is waiting! This is it! Our Pokemon Research Lab! Let's go! Ugh. What the? Oh, it's you, Domino! That old guy is not scary so much as he is totally out there! Oh, it doesn't matter, Domino. I'm out of here. See you later. Run into me again and I'm punching you in the face. Wow, what was that? Your friend seems your friend sure seems to be really impatient. Well, anyway, let's go inside. I bet I'm going a lot faster this time than I was the last time. Eh, about the same. Well, well, look who's here. Domino, was it? Let's have a look at your Pokemon. Well, well. You've already made your Pokemon evolve already? Entrusting you with that Rhydon was no mistake, it seems. Well, would you like me to, to give it a nickname? Yes, I would, and I'm gonna... At first, I forgot that... Random... I forgot that when Pokemon evolve, like, their nickname... Won't make sense, because I was... I had it pulled up, like, uh... I had given... I had named this thing Dromojamon, because I'm a Digimon fan. Uh, but I can't do that because when it evolves, uh, it won't be Dromojamon anymore. But we have Manali, the Rhydon, right? Manali, the Rhydon. Yes, I am happy with that name. When I first saw you two about to step in the tall grass without- Wait. When I first saw you two about to step in the tall grass without Pokemon, I was shocked. I was astounded by these foolhardy children. But now you've astounded me in a way, in an entirely different way. Already, there is a bond growing between you and that Pokemon. I feel privileged to have met you. I'm sure Rhydon feels the same way about you. <laughs> That's why I'll ask you to cherish that Rhydon of yours. I'm so glad you're kind towards Pokemon. If you weren't, I'd have to... Oh, I just can't say it. <clears throat> Let's move on to the main topic. There's something I want you to do for me. Allow me to properly introduce myself first. My name, as you know, is Rowan. I study Pokemon. First of all, I want to know exactly what kinds of Pokemon live in the Sinnoh region. Now, I brought this up the first time I recorded this. How long has he lived here? Hasn't he lived here for X number of years? How does he not know the Pokemon that live in the Sinnoh region? That doesn't make any sense. To do so, it's necessary to collect data using the Pokedex. This is what I wish to ask of you. I want to entrust you with this Pokedex. Will you? Yes, I will. Good answer. It would have forced me to say yes anyway. Ah, my back itches. That Pokedex is a very high-tech device. It will automatically record data on every Pokemon you encounter. Domino, I ask that you will go everywhere and meet every kind of Pokemon in this region. I've got one too. When you walked up Route 201 with your Pokemon, what did you feel? I've lived for 60 long years. Apparently none of them here in the center region. Apparently Rowan is new as well. Even now, I get a thrill when I'm with a Pokemon. Now, you should know that there are countless Pokemon in this world. That means there are just as many thrills waiting for you out there. Now, go! Domino, your grand adventure begins right now. The Pokemon that I met for the first time was a Chimchar. If you would have chosen a Chimchar on Route 201, we'd have the same Pokemon now. Not that it matters, but anyway, I'm done. I also helped the Professor add pages to the Pokedex. So in a sense, I'm just like you. I've got a little head start on you, that's all. I'll be happy to teach you things. Glad to meet you, Domino. Actually, your Chimchar is level 5. And my... Oh, you know what? I didn't even check out... Had all the time in the world to do it right there. Domino. I, I have something good here. You should take this as well. And I didn't even check what the TM was before. Gosh, I'm all over the place. I don't need you to explain the TM to me. Thank you, Rowan. Goodbye. I also don't need you to explain what a Pokemon Center and a Pokemart is. Goodbye, Don. Goodbye, Don. Now, let's take this moment to meet Anali. Our Dark Rock type. Fighting types are going to absolutely obliterate me. Relaxed Nature, that's a defensing boosting. We have Magma Armor to prevent us from becoming frozen, so that's... Meh. Meh. But those stats are pretty good. Speed is a little lower than everything else, but I'm not upset about that. I'm not upset about this at all. Not upset at all. I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna run in here and heal. And then we're going to head back. Yeah, let's head back. Oh, wait. 
a couple other things I need to do. First thing is I'm going to come down here and grab this item. Really, I found a luxury ball. Can I sell that luxury ball for more than I can buy a Pokeball? Is this real strats coming in? One potion. Get rid of that luxury ball! Confuse Ray. I'll hold on to Confuse Ray. That could actually be really good. I'm gonna hold off on buying Pokeballs right now. Because if I buy Pokeballs, the lock begins. Now, I'm not going to... I could do the cheap thing and scout out the Lake Verity. Or the Lake Acuity? Verity. Should I scope this out? Should I scope this out or should I make this random? Let's have fun. Let's not scope it out. I didn't scope it out the first time. But the first time I ran into the same Pokemon in all three routes that I went to. Now I came back because I have to go talk to mom again. And then three encounters and that will be episode number one. Welcome home Domino. Are you and your Pokemon healthy? I just made dinner. Take a quick rest dear. What is it Domino? Wow, Professor Rowan asked you to do something that big? Okay, dear, go for it. Your mom's got your back. Oh, I know, Domino. I've got something that you'll find useful. A journal. Don't need you to tell me that. Gee, a journey full of adventure. I envy you, kiddo. Plus, you're not alone. You have your Pokemon with you. I wish I could go instead. I'm just joking, dear. Yep, Domino. I'll be alright here by myself, so you go and enjoy your adventure. When you're exposed to new things and experiences, new sensations, it makes your mother happy, too. But, come back sometimes. I would like to see the kinds of Pokemon you've caught, dear. Um, excuse me! Is my little Sam's here? Oh? No, he's he's not. Oh, he must have left already. What to do? That boy shouted about going on an adventure and then he bolted. He's so headstrong and reckless. I at least wanted him to take this. Not to worry, Domino will deliver that to him. Won't you, Domino? Oh, really? You do that for me? Domino, please take this to Sam's for me. Okay, I just didn't need to hear that stuff. All right, here we go. Back to talk to Don. All right, back to talk to Don, back to talk to Don, back to talk to Don. Now I'm not gonna grow any more levels. Now we're gonna come up here and speak to Don. Now, last time she encountered some wild legend, like it did the old legendary encounter for her. Oh, that's right. Domino, I haven't shown you how to catch a Pokemon. I'll demonstrate you how to catch one, so just watch me, okay? Okay, no legendary this time for her. She gets a Meowth. That's much less hype than what she had before. And last time she got blown. Oh, you, go check it out. Go check it out. It's in the description. Flame Wheel and Cross Chop. Nice and randomized. Dragon Dance. Dragon Dance Meowth. Interessante. Its HP is down. It's ready for a Pokeball. Really. Really, really. Okay, Don. I... Okay. <laughs> See? Isn't it neat? Actually, it's better to lower your target's HP more than I did. It's important to get the Pokemon's HP down as low as possible. This is because a very healthy Pokemon... What? This is because a very healthy Pokemon is very difficult to catch. Blah, 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 blah. Thank you for the five Pokeballs. Goodbye. Don't run into a Pokemon on this one blade of grass. Thank you. I think... Our first... No. I think I need to be smart and buy more because I'm not a dum-dum. I've got to have that Gyarados. I've got to have that Gyarados. I've got to have that Gyarados. Or excuse me, that Blastoise. I have to have it. I have to have it. I have to have it. Wonder Guard. 
Wonder Guard. I have to have that Blastoise. Let me go up here. Our first encounter, we're gonna risk it. Wait. No, I'm gonna risk it for Blastoise. Because if I die against Blastoise, the lock hasn't begun yet. I'm so nervous, I'm so nervous, I'm so nervous, I'm so nervous. Come on. Oh! Charizard. Please. Please, Charizard. Please, Charizard. Oh my god, I encountered a freaking Charizard. No. Stop. Use the other move. Use the... Use, um... Use Growl. Lower my attack so I can hit you. I will not give this up. Oh. 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 Yes. Yes, Charizard. Yes. Come on, 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 come on. Yes! Oh my goodness! Episode 1, first encounter, Pokemon Platinum, starts off with my favorite Pokemon next to me of all time. Of all time. It is said that Charizard's fire burns hotter if it has experienced harsh battles. The flying water Pokemon. Don't get hit by electric, please, Charizard. Please, Charizard. That is incredibly amazing. Now, I know what you're going to say. The Blastoise would have been better. Yeah, shut up. Shut up, all right? Just shut up. My favorite Pokemon. We have Osco the Charizard. Now, how many episodes do you think it's gonna be till he dies? Cause I'm not getting attached to this thing. Technician powers up the Pokemon's weaker moves. Whoa, that like really. Oh my God, this thing has Stab Hydro Pump. From, 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 uh, so wait, Vacuum Wave, that means Vacuum Wave actually does 80, doesn't it? It doubles? Hey Siri, what does Technician do in Pokemon? I found Thanks. Technician does 80. So I'm going to figure out what Technician does in Gen 4. Four. Increases by 50%, so it actually does 60. Okay, I gotcha. I gotcha. So it actually does 60. That's, I mean, pff, I'm not complaining at all. That's freaking awesome. I'm so happy. I just got a, I just got a Charizard. Oh my gosh. Okay. And I have like 13 or 12 Pokeballs to catch two other Pokemon in this episode. That's, oh my, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. What's our encounter here? It's a Raichu, okay. Okay. I'm gonna assume a headbutt's not gonna kill. Right, you stay in the ball, please. Stay in the ball, please. Right, okay. Nice shark. I, I can't hit it again. All right, I need to decide how many balls I'm gonna use. I will use three more. Ah, I will use three more on Raichu because Raichu doesn't learn anything by level up. That's actually, I use two more. Uh, I use two more now.
I have no problem with the Raichu, but I, I just can't give up these Pokeballs when this thing won't learn moves. All right, thank you for the experience. What else was in this grass? Geodude? Geodude. 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 My voice isn't low enough to go do a good Geodude. I'm so excited that we got a freaking Charizard. We could have had a Caterpie! Which, I mean, Caterpie could be cool. Also, if you want spoilers on what Pokemon would evolve into, you can check out the description. There's a paste bin to all of the spoilers. Um, but, I mean, like I said, it's spoilers, so just know that. Just know that. Alright, we're going in with Manali again. This is our next encounter. It is a Vulpix. With Snow Warning. Is this an Alolan Vulpix? If you would have hit my freaking... Okay. Well... You know... And I will not be holding the speed up button as much as I did in this episode. I think part of why I was holding the speed up button so much is because... I'm not going to be able to save this file. So I'm going to have to replay through it. That's okay. I can get back to where we were. I think. Assuming everything randomized the same. Oh, man. Anyway, you don't have to worry about that. I don't know how much I'm going to be able to get recorded ahead of time like I need to. But anyway, we're, let, let's forget about that. Um, this was episode one of our Pokemon Platinum Severely Randomized Nuzlocke. And it turned out to be extremely, extremely hype because of our encounter that we did catch. We did miss out on two encounters one, because I just didn't want to catch that that Raichu, because it can't learn anything except TMs. And then that Vulpix, who killed itself. Freaking cool. In the next episode, we'll be grinded up to level 5 for everybody, or maybe level 7, since there's only two of us. And we're going to head off into the next city. If you wound up enjoying episode 1, make sure you hit the like button down below. And do comment your question of the day, which again was... What's your favorite gift that you gave this year for Christmas, or maybe a year in the past? If you th can't think of anything, let me know what your favorite gift that you received was. That'll be just fine. In the next episode, uh, I already talked about all this. Oh my gosh, I'm on like a loop right now. Uh, and again, lastly, hit the subscribe button to become a member of the Domination, and we will see you in the next episode. Until then, have a blessed day and Merry Christmas.